Hey yo, it's Ash Angelic. <laughs> How's everybody today? Oh, let me move the microphone a little bit closer to me. Is the music too loud? I hope not. <laughs> I'll turn it down just a slight bit. <laughs> it's been a long day. <sighs> been busy. Busy day for magical girls, you know? Like, a lot of bad guys to beat up. <sighs> and I got my tea here. A little hot. Um, so I might... So I probably won't be talking too loud today. Or at least, like, not super loud. Because, um... I got a bit of a sore throat. I can and will beat you up, biggest man. I will. Don't test me. Meet me outside the Wendy's. 6 a.m. Do it. Hmm. Ooh, it's still a little too hot. My throat's like really sensitive, so it's like, ah. But yeah, I'm gonna be a bit quiet, so it's gonna be a bit of an unintentional ASMR stream. <laughs> um, my throat's been sore for like the last few days, so I don't know what's causing it. Because I did test, it's not COVID. I would love pie, what kind? What kind of pie? Because I, I won't eat, like, fish pie, because I'm not the biggest seafood person. I know that's, like, a thing, like, fish pot pie. Kind of like chicken pot pie. Oh, speaking of which, I have soup. I'm eating chicken noodle soup, because I thought, cause thought it would be easier to swallow. Oh, that sounds so good. Fried apple peach cream pie. Yum. Mmm. Gotta eat the soup before it gets cold. But yeah, fried apple peach pie. That sounds delicious. I would love that. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah! I should open a P.O. box so you guys can send me shit. Um, well, maybe not. <laughs> I don't know, people on the internet are weird. Maybe so, like, a few of my, uh, friends can send me stuff, because I feel weird giving out my address, you know? You can- you can send it to me through the internet. <laughs> Email me some pie, biggest man. <laughs> Email me a JPEG of your pie. I'll put- I'll put some pictures of the, uh, pie on- the discord and I'll I'll eat it through osmosis I'll absorb the pixels mm. tea is so hot um, I hope I put enough I like tea better with milk but uh, my milk went bad so I need to go get some more but I got it but it has lots of sugar in it so that's all that matters My soup's getting cold, so I'm probably gonna just stop eating that. Yee! You do you like to cook, biggest man? I'm I I like cooking in theory, but like it's mainly the cleanup I don't like. I have so many dishes in my sink right now that I'm like uh, I don't want to. I'll probably clean them up tomorrow because you know I don't have much planned tomorrow. Still. Uh, I'm not- I'm still deciding if I want to stream on Sunday. Yeah! Honestly, though, most of the time I don't have the energy to cook. Though, sometimes- sometimes cooking can be just as easy as, like, I'm gonna take this sausage, put the oven on broil, and pop it in there for a few minutes, take it out, boom. Yummy sausage. Um, I like to eat that sausage with, um, with mac and cheese. Again, I'm out of milk, so I need to go get more milk so I can make mac and cheese. But honestly, I think Mel's uh, Mel's probably a better cook than me. I mean, I like cooking and like she's like good at experimenting and just like doing random shit, like cooking with like whatever the hell she has, you know. I always have to have like a recipe is the thing. I like baking though. Baking's fun. Again, I don't do it that often, but I like it. 
Mm. I'm gonna readjust a little bit. <sighs> Just in the back of my chair. The gamer chair. Mm. I'm trying to cook more often because I eat out too much and that's costing way too much money, honestly. Baked you a pie! It was a- it was a... Oh boy, what a flavor! Pie flavor! <laughs> God, Astiff movie though. That was, damn. That's some early internet nostalgia right there. Sophie, I see you eyeing the desk. You can't have soup. Soup is not for cat. I see you eyeing the soup, kitty. The soup is not for the kitty. It is for the people, kitty. Soup is not for you. It's also getting kind of cold, so I'm probably not going to finish it. Sophie. Alright, hang on. She's in front of my tracking. Let me go, go let me go put this bowl away so she doesn't like stick her face in it real quick. Hang on. Ear beat. But yeah, what have you been up to, biggest man? Been a hot second. I know I haven't, like, streamed in a minute. I've just been kind of, <laughs> I don't know, tired. It's a long thing. I think part of it is because I started- oh. Ah! No! I dropped my plush! Hang on. <laughs> I have a little, uh, Luna Moth plush that is the cutest thing ever. And I wanted to hold it during stream. Come on, Sophie. Come on. Come here. Come here for snuggles. Come on. It's snuggle time, kitty. Get your tail out of- get your tail away from my tea. You're gonna- you're gonna get hair in it, baby. Aww. Psst, 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 psst. Um, what was I saying? Oh, right. I I'm wondering if it's because I started taking my meds again. Because they're great for anxiety- not having random anxiety attacks at work, but they're also, like, make you kind of sleepy, is the thing. But yeah, it's honestly, honestly though, like, for a while I stopped taking them because I thought they were making thing, because I was having trouble remembering to take them and, um, and it was a bit, um, yeah, yeah. Well, I take my meds in the morning, but... Honestly, that's it's better to take them in the morning, but like then again, I I don't know. Um, cause that's when I'll remember to do it usually. Hey, Sophia. You getting all snuggly, baby? <laughs> um, yeah. Uh. But you know. Well, it's also my work schedule's like kind of all over the place is the thing, so I guess I'm not used to that. And I guess social media has been making me kind of anxious in general, but honestly, it's a lot easier to handle with the meds. <laughs> oh, my fourth! Hi, Rhea! Hi, hi, hi! Oh, that was loud. I startled Kitty. Hi. Ugh. Ugh. That was not good on my throat. Um, but yeah, I have a bit of a sore throat today, so I may not be as energetic as usual. I might- I'm gonna- this is gonna be an unintentional ASMR stream. I might whisper a bit later. <laughs> um, Sophie's purring. Um, I just- it was a regular 4th of July. Spent it with the family, you know? Uh, and speaking of anxiety, I just- I remember- Okay, can I tell you about the way my family celebrates the 4th of July? Um, I don't know what it is, but my family is very reckless with fireworks. Not, like, no one's gotten, like, seriously hurt or anything, but, like, I swear, every year, almost every year, uh, when we would go do our big family, uh, fireworks, um, one of them always falls over into the direction of the people watching, and it's like, damn it, this happens every year. Thankfully, 
um, no one's ever gotten hurt by this, but it's also like scary as hell. And uh, me and my sister were like sitting next to each other, and I can tell she's also like super anxious, like looking at the fireworks, like wow. Chippy, hi, 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 Chippy. We're doing a chill tea stream, so. Right now, it's just me talking. I'm talking about the least chill thing, which is fireworks going towards you. There's this old picture of my dad he has where he has like fireworks strapped to his. I think it was from before I was born, but it's where he has fireworks like he has his shirt off and he has fireworks strapped to his chest. <laughs> so silly. They weren't lit, thankfully, but it was like it was like it was like little cracker things. It was like it was like tiny little ones that kind of look like dynamite. Aww. Sophie's getting so cuddly. Can you guys hear her purring? Probably not. She's not very close to the mic. Uh, but yeah, um... Sorry, this music's making me more sleepy than I already was. <laughs> um, but yeah. Um, there were like those little, uh, cracker thingies. Uh, it kind of looked like tiny sticks of dynamite and they come in like strips and he had them strapped across his chest like Rambo style. It was really funny. I don't, I don't think I'll show you guys a picture of my dad, but I found it and it's like really fun. It's really funny looking to me. It's also really weird seeing pictures of your parents from like before you were born. It's like, oh my god, what the fuck? What the fuck? You weren't always a raisin? <laughs> That's mean. I, my parents were actually fairly young when they had me. I mean... I consider 30 fairly young. Well, I guess not fairly young to be having kids, but still. Mm. Okay. Sophie got up and left because she got tired of my talking. Yeah, those little fireworks. Firecrackers. He had those strapped across his chest. I, I hope chat doesn't have a lag right now. Um... Job. Now it's at like the perfect temperature for my throat, which is great. Like, I can't drink anything cold right now because it hurts my throat, but if I drink something warm, it's like a lot better. Um. <clears throat> but yeah, I I'm gonna try to talk a bit quieter because I think it's straining it. Um. But yeah, um. But yeah, I was trying to say that microwave steak. You. <laughs> I mean, I'm not one to talk. I, I just had microwave soup. I mean, it's not bad soup, but still. Uh, how do you guys like eat like, like chicken noodle soup? Cause I, the way I eat it, I put like so many crackers in it, you can't even see the soup. It's mostly just crackers. <laughs> my, me and my sister do the same exact thing. Mm. But yeah, me and my sister did the same exact thing. We like... You don't? You don't eat soup? You drink soup? Hmm. Oh, we also had hot dogs. Work had me a bit late on firework on fi uh, 4th of July, but um, I managed to make it to my parents' place and so they had already, like, done most of dinner, but, like, they still had, like, hot dogs and stuff left over, so it's fine. Oh, you don't like any soup? Not, like, not even, like, tomato soup? Soup is, like, the essence of all living things, though. Like, it's the essence of food. Fairsaw is correct. Cereal is a soup. It's a sweet soup. There are sweet soups out there. Out what's it called there's like this like chilled strawberry soup i've had before it's like kind of a sweet dessert desserty soup it's pretty good actually i've had chilled cucumber soup too well then you're just a fucking monster my dude yeah the ocean is a soup it's a primordial soup by the way welcome uh fairsa <clears throat> Your first time here? Mm. I'm usually a bit more energetic, but I had a bit of a long day at work, and um, also my throat's a bit sore, so I'm gonna be talking quieter than usual. It's gonna be an unintentional ASMR stream. 
Hi, hi. Soup is actually tea. Mm, I mean, sure. Yes. You do primordial pouch. Just jiggle it. She does not like it when I do that. She gets very bitey. <laughs> it's like, she like just lay in there with your tummy out like, mm, and I'm just like, <laughs> and she's like, Meh. starts biting. <clears throat> oh, it's too loud. Sorry. <laughs> Tea is leaf soup. Leaf soup. You are correct. <laughs> it is, it is leaf water and I like it. It's yummy leaf water. God. How do you guys like your tea, by the way? Leaf soup. You don't drink tea? What do you what do you eat, biggest man? Biggest man, do you eat? How do you get sustenance? I like herbal tea. I like <clears throat> too loud. I like uh uh mint herbal tea. That stuff's really good. Ooh, and raspberry. Raspberry herbal tea is really good. So I kind of prefer it cold. What meat do you eat, biggest man? <laughs> I'm gonna turn the music down a little bit. It's making me sleepy. <laughs> mm, Lofi beats. Speaking of which, like all of Lofi girls' songs are like free to use on streams, but for some reason, like they keep getting mistaken for other songs, which is weird. Just like, have you have you ever eaten like uh, deer meat? It's not bad. I mean, my dad likes to eat it sometimes, though. Sometimes he works. So fun fun fact about meat. Uh, my dad, when I was a kid, he still does this, but like I don't. And like sometimes when I come over, um, so basically um, when I was a kid and he um, he would do uh, work for this guy who owned like a slaughter house was it a slaughterhouse or a butcher's i forget but um he would get like and instead of like paying my dad he would pay my dad in meat venetian i don't know what that means <laughs> um basically like a whole cow worth of meat well actually no actually no he didn't pay him in meat he paid him he would Basically, my dad would, like, he worked for him a lot, but he would also end up getting, like, discounts on their stuff. So he ended up getting a lot of meat from the guy. So much- oh. I don't eat it a lot, so I wouldn't know. Fun f okay, so. I, I have a fun thing to tell about uh, my, uh, my, my sister. Uh, she was talking to some foreign exchange students from France one time. Um. <clears throat> Sorry. She was talking to some foreign exchange students from France one time. Um, I'm gonna turn my mic up a bit. And she was saying that... Um, so basically they were getting food somewhere and it had meat in it. And my sister was asking, Oh, uh, what's the meat in it? And like, the uh, girl, the French girl didn't know the English word for it. She couldn't think of it at the time. And so she was like trying to find a picture of of the animal and the picture she finds is a picture of Bambi <laughs> and she's like yeah yeah it's it's this animal it's like oh god <laughs> my sister is like the huge the biggest Disney simp I know she is way too into Disney stuff um but okay fun ooh silver to cherry ooh chamomile <laughs> I like I like Earl Grey a lot. Is it is it bad that I started drinking Earl Grey when I was a teenager because because it was a drink and because it was drunk a lot by a character in an anime I liked. I thought I'm going to try this tea and I tried it and now I drink it all the time. I also like Madame Grey. That's a good tea. Ew. Ew. Garbage. I guess garbage water would be tea, but it's like it's but it's tea for raccoons. <laughs> Oh, blue, <clears throat> the blue butterfly tea, like, what's it called? The pea something tea, the, the pea flower, the pea flower tea. Yeah, where it, like, it changes to blue. Oh, I want it, that, I want to know what that tastes like. It looks very pretty. <sighs> mm. 
it tastes blue. <laughs> so like blue raspberry? It tastes like it tastes blue, I assume. Like what I'm thinking you ever think about like the how blue raspberry exists? Cause that's not a fucking fruit. But like, you know like someone like invented that flavor and they were like, well this sure as hell tastes blue. <laughs> You know what I mean? <laughs> it's still like one of my favorite candy flavors, so blue raspberry is the shit. I guess, but I don't think it really tastes like blueberry either. Hmm. Let's see here. Hmm. Love. You know what berries I really like though? I really love blackberries and I need- I want there to be more stuff that uses blackberries because blackberries are delicious. I love blackberries. I want- I need to- f I want to try making blackberry jam at some point, but like that can be very difficult. What's going on with my face tracking? Come on. Ah? Ah, blah, blah. Hang on. You don't like jam? Hold on, let me let me see if I can fix my face tracking. There we go. That was being weird for a second. Mm. You don't like jam? Then what do you put on your toast? Mulberries. I've never had mulberries. Wait, are those like a different those are like those uh those are those uh berries that are kinda like Blackberries and raspberries like together, right? Or am I confused? Ooh. True. My toaster is broken right now, so I can't make toast. No. <laughs> the, the correcting to the smiley face. I never put maple syrup though on my toast. Is that like a thing? Do people put honey on toast? I, I know people put honey on pancakes and so Oh, you're in Canada. Oh, Nutella is fucking good. You know, like... Uh, coffee spread? What the fuck? the fuck you mean coffee spread? Hmm. What do you mean coffee spread? What is going on with my face tracking? <laughs> Stop doing that. It's getting like weirdly choppy. Hang on, let me... Mess with some settings real quick. I'm gonna, hang on, I'm gonna exit wide IO for a sec. <sighs> oh. I just got a big loogie, gross. <laughs> uh, that hurt my throat. That hurt my throat to do. Hmm. Maybe it's my frame rate settings? Cause I set them lower cause I thought it would help my uh, Hmm. I'll mess with it later. Sorry. <laughs> Got distracted. Ooh. Oh, hi. Oh, hi, Robbie. What's up? Ah. 
Uh, hang on, I... Ooh. <laughs> that's how you make- No, that's not how French toast work, honey. French toast, though, is fucking good. It, like... Like, I'm not amazing at making French toast, but... You ever had you ever have like stuffed French toast? Like French toast with like cream cheese and shit inside? Really? I mean, to be fair, um. Hmm. I mean, I love pancakes, though, are the thing. The thing is, I I fucking love pancakes. I tend to eat them more than French toast. But I like French toast, too. Here's my eggs with steak and cheese. So, oh, you make, like, omelets? I like making omelets a lot. Because, like, I don't know. A lot of time. Just, like, even if it's just, like, a cheese omelet with, like, a ton of, like, oregano and shit put in there. Just because I can. Hmm. Ches. What? I mean, I don't dislike waffles, but I prefer pancakes. Pancakes are like the best. Mm. I'm weird. I'm a weirdo. You ever seen me without this stupid hat? <laughs> uh, sorry, my back's kind of hurting, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it comfy. Basic bitch. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. I guess I really like soft foods. I like crunchy, but it depends on the food. Like, my favorite food... I, I list my favorite food as strawberry shortcake, and it is, because you got, like, you got the soft cake, you got the, the whipped cream, and you got the strawberries, which add, like, a little bit of crunch, but, like, the tartness that mix really well with, like, the cream and cake, it's so good. Texture. I mean, I like- I'm weird about texture, to be honest. Like, I love texture. I like foods that are a certain texture. If it's, like, slightly off, I'm just like, meh. I like cake a lot. Mm. So just, like, plain yellow cake or, like, vanilla cake? Ice cream cake is the fucking best. That's the shit right there. It's very hard to cut though. <laughs> it's good though. Ice cream cake is the best cake in existence. Honestly, yeah. There's only one flavor of ice cream that I don't usually like. There's one... You don't like fruit and cakes? That's like the best kind of cake, though. What? You guys have terrible taste, my dudes. <laughs> but legit, like... Okay, can we talk about ice cream flavors for a sec? Because apparently, fucking mint chocolate chip is a controversial ice cream flavor, even though it's the best fucking flavor in existence. Soy cakes? So is it like made with soy milk instead of regular milk? Apparently, apparently there are people that don't like mint chocolate chip, which is insane. <laughs> It's the best fucking ice cream flavor. Don't fucking at me. You can have your goddamn pistachio. I mean, fair. But, like, to me, the, if the chocolate chips add, like, a perfect amount of, like, texture and, like, just, like, a little bit of, like, extra-ness to the... Just, like, a little bit of chocolatey flavor to go with the mint. Fair enough. It's like eating popcorn. You get, like, the kernels stuck in your teeth. 
Oh, by the way, Robbie, um, I'm gonna be talking a little bit quieter this stream. That's why I turned my mic up a bit. Uh, because, um, yes, mint is so good. Mint is good on so many shit. I love mint. Me and Robbie love mint. Mint stands. <laughs> um, but yeah. Um, but yeah, my throat's kind of sore today. It's been sore for the last few days. And I'm trying to, like, be a bit more quiet today. Though I keep failing. <laughs> <laughs> this is why I haven't done an ASMR stream yet, because I would be so bad at it. I couldn't stay quiet. <laughs> mm hmm I mean, I like popcorn is the thing. I also, I, you know, I like that thing where you can just, like, drizzle, like, you can, like, make chocolate popcorn. That stuff's good. It's a good little snack. Mint, though. Anything mint is really good. Honestly. Oh. I was blocking. Oh, hello. Tracking. Hello. <laughs> Strawberry chocolate fondue. That is the shit right there. Strawberry chocolate. Amazing. Um, but like, okay, I was talking about mint. You know what drink I really love? Mojitos. Like, I usually don't like drinks that are like super strong, but somehow like the mint in mojitos like really offsets like the alcohol taste and I love it. But yeah, chocolate and strawberry is like match made in heaven, chef's kiss, mwah. But okay, I was at the grocery store and I saw these like, this like fudge stripe cookies, but it was like strawberry fudge stripe cookies. And I'm like, oh, chocolate strawberry fudge stripe cookies. And I'm like, oh, I'm good. I have to get this. And I buy them. Fair. I like, I kind of like some wines. I'm not like a, but I don't really like beer at all. Ugh. Sorry, that hurt. Um, but yeah, um, strawberry chocolate fondue. Uh, oh, right, the- I went to the store and there were these, like, strawberry fudge stripe cookies that are, like, chocolate strawberry cookies. I decided to buy some. I buy them. I eat one. It does not taste like strawberry. It tastes like trash. <laughs> it literally- it tasted like someone sprayed, like, strawberry like perfume scented perfume on this really shit cookie it did not taste like strawberry and i hated it i threw that right in the trash fair enough i don't drink alcohol my my family is my my mom and my sister are very <laughs> into alcohol so i end up drinking a bit more but i'm not much of an alcohol person i don't drink it a lot but it's more of like a special occasion type thing Fair enough. Like, some alcohol can be really nasty. I, I honestly don't prefer drinking it just straight. I kind of just, like, prefer cocktails, you know? Mm. But I don't get why people like beer, though. It's It tastes so gross. You can't, ah, that makes sense. Fruity drinks are good, though. Yeah, I was talking about my- yeah. I feel like a lot of people's dads like beer. <laughs> my dad also enjoys a beer. It's That's like the quintessential dad thing, though, is a can of fucking beer and a grill or some shit. I'm glad it's not like cold yet, my tea, because like if I've been having a hard time swallowing cold things today. <laughs> you know, well, I'm not drinking alcohol right now. I just have a uh, tea. We were talking. We were. Just, I was just talking about like mint, and like usually I don't like cocktails with like the strong alcohol flavor. Oh, well, then get a drink first off. Okay, get some water. All right, hydrate. But yeah, um, I was just talking about how I usually don't like, uh, um, cocktails that are, um, that, like, have a strong alcohol flavor, but, like, mojitos are the exception because the mint, like, really complements it. Ah, uh, 
That sucks. Do you not have a sink on your floor? Hi, Q! What's up? How, what's up? How's, how's my favorite angel dude? How have you been? Sorry I haven't been, like, super talkative lately. <laughs> Um, I'm, I'm really tired, so I'm gonna have a bit of low energy today, but hey, what's up? I'm just over here drinking some tea, trying to soothe my throat. Ooh. Which is why I'm gonna be talking a bit quieter today. Hello, hello. <laughs> We're just chilling and vibing. Just chatting. Hmm. <laughs> ah. This music makes me more sleepy. <laughs> I just said that. Would you guys be down for like an ASMR stream though? Like it doesn't have to be like biannual or anything, but like, cause I don't have one of those mics, but I don't know. How would you feel about that kind of shit? Honestly, I, I would love to do one of those like weird ASMR roleplay videos. Nothing like sexual or anything. Cause that, cause I feel like a lot of people do that and I'm like, no. Hell yeah, ASMR. I just like. So that does that like work without a biannual microphone? I don't know if I have like good settings for that or like stuff set up to be that. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I'm just readjusting, trying to get a bit closer to my mic. <laughs> but yeah, how are you, Q? How? By the way, Robbie, how how are you today? How is work? What'd you do? Oh, okay, that is capturing on the mic. I don't know what that sounds like, but you're fine, Q. That's cool. It's good to hear. A lot of shit's happening in the world, so, like... Yeah, I would work for my mic. Doing that, like, mic rubs. <laughs> I would- I think I would need to get some practice- I- I keep accidentally talking too loud. I would- I would need to get some- oh, Tracking. Work with me today. Same old, same old? Yeah, nothing- Well, at least it wasn't, like, super stressful or anything. Is this a rub? Yeah, I'm just like rubbing it against my microphone. What does that sound like? Really? Aw, you lonely, Robbie? Well, thanks for stopping by. I always appreciate chatting with you. <laughs> I don't really know how I would do ASMR. Well, I have like a, what's it called? Those, like, little shields you put on your mics to keep wind from getting in it. I forgot what they're called, but, like, I have one on my mic, so that might be why it sounds like that. Yeah. I also want to play more Fall Guys with you. Well, that was fun. I also want to get into Minecraft, but I don't want to buy it. <laughs> I don't want to buy Minecraft. Don't make me buy Minecraft. <laughs> but, like, I like, I like Minecraft a lot. I used to play it a lot as a kid, and I never... I... I don't know, I wanna try it again. <laughs> mm. Oh, guess what I bought at the Steam sale? Guess. I bought a couple games, but there's... Me and my two copies of my friend. Yeah, Fall Guys is fun. We should, I should stream Fall Guys. It would be a fun like collab thing. Yeah, guess what I got at the Steam sale? Guess what I got at the Steam sale? You gotta guess. It's no fun if you don't guess. Ugh. No. Ah, it wants me to log in again. Why does it want me to log in? Oh, duh. I got a game, yeah. No shit. Um. Oh, hey. They have like the remake of a uh, Colonia out on Steam. Okay.
Uh, oh, thank you for the stretch. Thank you for the stretch, 2000. <laughs> I did get, well, I got um, AI the Somnium Files, which is a surreal murder mystery game where you go into people's dreams and shit. <laughs> and I'm really, I want to stream it eventually. Um, maybe not right away, but I'm excited that I have it. Yay! <laughs> Sorry, I'm just like trying to not be so loud because my it's gonna hurt my throat if I do. <laughs> um, what else did I get? Uh, where do, 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 do. I'm trying to remember. Uh, oh, I also got Planet Zoo and Slime Rancher. Oh, you're fine, Robbie. Mm, I don't want to wrestle. I'm too tired. I'm sweepy. No, I'm just a big sweepy. Hold on. Hold on. I have a thing for this. Hang on. I'm sweepy. No. Sweepy. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just fucking tired, my dude. I'm not sick, thankfully. I don't think I'm sick. I think I've just been talking too much. <laughs> mm. But yeah, I've actually never played Slime Rancher, and I don't really know a lot about how it works. I can turn on and fix you up real fast. Sophie, I see you over here. What you doing? What you doing, baby? Oh, come on, you big asshole. Come on. You big butt face. I love you. Oh, oh, you're blocking my camera, sweetheart. You're blocking my camera. Come here. Sophie, get on my lap. There you go, your big butt face. You're a little butt face. She's, n oh, she's not your enemy. She's a cutie patootie little kitty cat. Hmm. <sighs> Hmm. What kind of ASMR do you guys like, though, if you're into him, you know? Because I don't know what, like... Ah. But Robbie's also allergic to cats, but he loves kitties. <laughs> Sophie is so sweet. And Sophie is, like, extra fluffy, so she's, like... And sheds, like, all the time, so she's, like, extra allergies. Sophie, what are you doing? Get your... Stop it, you big butt. <laughs> Sophie, stop sticking your face in things that you're not supposed to, sweetheart. Hmm. Yeah, but you die instantly. Yeah, fair enough. RPs might be fun. Sophie... Best way to die is is suffocated by kitty cat. Hey, Sophia, don't stop sticking your face on the wires, you big butt. <laughs> you guys are just chill and talk, though. Oh, also, I want to do some VR chat content. Ferrets? Ferrets are so cute. I had a... My, my dad had a friend who had ferrets. And they were the cutest little guys, and my mom hated them. She was so- she did not like any sort of rodent resembling creature. And she- and I'm like, But I love these little guys! They're little noodles! They're fuzzy little noodle guys! <laughs> Ferrets! Ferrets and chinchillas. Chinchillas are so cute and soft, I love them. Like, small animals are like the cutest shit to me. I love squirrels, I love chinchillas, I love the ferrets. Sophie, I see you trying to put your face in things you don't... 
Oh, they had three ferrets? Holy shit, that's a lot of ferrets. That's a lot of ferrets. Sophie, I see what you're trying to do, sweetheart. Damn. Honestly, well, she thought they smelled bad. She didn't like ferrets because she said they smelled bad, which is like... That's literally any animal, though. Any animal can smell bad. <laughs> Are you grumpy? Hi. Hmm. What's in? Animals are very hard to take care of, though. A lot of really cool animals you they could you could get as a pet, but like, very hard to get. Very hard to take care of. Mm. Yeah, at one point I wanted- I remember last week I really wanted to do like a late night uh, YouTube poop stream where I just watch like random YouTube poops. But like, I was like way too tired to do it and ended up canceling it. <laughs> it was just like I was having a bit of a long day. And today I had a long day, but, you know, it's chill because it's a just chatting stream, you know? We're just vibing here. Ooh. Oh. Well, hopefully they find some good owners for them if they can't take care of them anymore, you know? Oh, are you grumpy at me, kitty? Are you grumpy at me? I want you to let you sit on the desk. You shouldn't be sitting on the desk, baby. Don't be sitting on the desk, babies. Aw, big snuggly butt. <laughs> oh. oh, um. How, do any of y'all play VR chat? I was thinking I might try to get more into VR chat stuff. But I want to try to. I, I want to try. To get my oculus to work with the uh with steam but it was having issues for some reason need to figure that shit out mm. are you mad at me kitty yeah i have an oculus quest too but like yeah well i mean oof. well the thing is like i don't think the uh quest version people on like Sophie! I I don't think... So, isn't there, like, a thing where, like, people on the Quest version of VRChat can't... Sophia! I see you, you little shit! Stop trying to get into shit that you're not supposed to! Sophie... Hold on. Hold on. Cat! Move! Kitty, no! That is not for cat! That is not for cat! That is not for cat. That is not for cat. Why? Mm, mother, I want to eat yummy wires. No, you do not. You do not wish to eat the yummy wires. They are not yummy. They are full of death. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, well, isn't there like a thing where like, if you're an Oculus Quest, to you can't connect to like people who use the PC version of VR chat. I don't know. I'm a bit confused about how that works. Because I do have VR chat on my Oculus Quest, but I was trying to see if I could get it work work with the Steam version so I could play Steam VR games. And also like use the same account and all that. For like cases I just didn't want to go into VR, you know? I also want to upload my model to VR chat. I need to figure out how to do that. Find a lot of YouTube tutorials on it. Hmm. 
Sophie, I see you trying to give shit. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of people use MMD models on VR chat, but like mine's a Vroid model, and I want to see if I can get it to work in VR chat, like a VRM model, because like uh, MMD models are like a complete are like a different file type, so like it's a bit different, I think. So I don't know how that lines up, you know. Mm. There's tons of tutorials on it, I'm sure. I. Mm. <laughs> Kenny, what are you doing? <laughs> what do we do here? Mm. How do you guys feel about mukbangs? Like an ASMR mukbang? That might be nice. Mm. <laughs> mm. Some. Do you think I have, like, a good voice for ASMR? Because I feel like for some people, it's, like, doesn't work if you don't have the, uh... Yeah, that would be fun. And I could, like, do assets. You know, there's this thing I've seen. Uh, you have to have, like, a leap motion to do it, which tracks your, like, hand movements. But, like, if I ever got one, which they're expensive as fuck, so probably not, but... I would love to, like, just do one of those streams where people will, like, track their hands to their model and, like, cook something or do stuff like that. Yeah, it's like having dinner with friends. <laughs> um... though. I don't know, I'm just like, I don't watch a lot of mukbang videos, but I, I really like those ASMR cooking videos. Those are fun. The cooking tree makes really good ASMR cooking videos. What else is there I want to try? Mm -hmm. Just ASMR wise. Ooh, I could do like narration. I got in other games on stream on Steam. Um, I'm trying to remember. I f thought I bought one more, but I think I only bought three at the sale, which were Planet Zoo, Slime Rancher, and AI: The Somnium Files, which I am excited to stream. But I have other games. Oh, I should play Helltaker again. That was fun. Helltaker's a good game. I want to see if I can get, like, the uh, true ending. Yeah, Zoe! Those, like, cafe... She makes, like, really good cafe videos. Uh... I don't know. Hmm... It might be fun to do one of those, like, theme streams I see some VTubers do, where they, like, have, like, a whole scenario set up, like, a cafe thing or something. I don't know. Ooh, a slumber party. That'd be fun. Like, have... I, I'm working on a, pija a pajamas version of my model, but, like... It's basically done. I just need to, like, add the halo and wings to it and shit. But I don't feel like it. <laughs> Maybe when I have more energy. But yeah, it would be, like, nice to have... Well, I thought it would be cool to have for, like, chill streams like this. And, have, and like, maybe make, like, a uh, slumber party background. Because I think that would be fun. Because I like having chill stream. I can just talk about random shit that... I really like, like, 
weird murder mysteries. I was just thinking about like AI Bisomnia files and what I've seen of it, it's really fucking weird, but I'm kind of here for it. <laughs> I don't know, just something about like murder mysteries that don't take themselves too seriously or like just completely off the wall, you know? <laughs> Mm. Ooh, you know what would be a fun thing to do? I could do like a stream where I read like a public domain story like Alice in Wonderland. I love Alice in Wonderland. I'm so I know it's like a such an overused thing, but honestly, I just it's I'm such a sucker for anything Alice in Wonderland themed. It's my shit right there. I don't know, it's just like, something about it just speaks to my soul. <laughs> hmm. I remember at one point I had an idea for like, a point and click adventure game that was like, kind of like Wolf Among Us, but for kids. <laughs> and it would be like... The main character would be Alice, and I think she's a good fit for like a main a adventure game main character because she does a lot of like talking to herself and shit. <laughs> hmm. Isn't there a while where people literally just are streaming streams of themselves sleeping? Like, why was that a thing? Because I remember that being a thing, and it's like, that's some weird shit. <laughs> I just remembered that. What was up with that? Like, I can kind of get stuff like hot tub trends or whatever, but like, come on. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I would too. I'm, I'm actually, I was thinking about that because I was actually a bit worried I might fall asleep. Because this music's really chill and I'm a bit sleepy. <laughs> mm, but it's nice. It's nice. Mm. Ooh, I should. But yeah, slumber party. Oh, I should make up like slumber party games for like a stream like that. <laughs> I have seen that, yeah. It is really weird. There's a lot of really weird streams you can find on TikTok. I mean... Mm. Oh. Maybe I should... Oh, I'm too tired. <laughs> I was gonna say, maybe I should use this time to, like, actually get back into my Japanese studies, but I'm just like... No, too tired. <laughs> too tired. I don't want to go get my notebook. <laughs> hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, people would pay money for weird shit. I think I have Sims 4. Honestly though, I have a lot of Sims 3 shit. Just, I wanna- I do wanna do- I had this really stupid idea for like, a VTuber- <laughs> a VTuber reality show on Sims. I thought that would be really fun. I just like, make a bunch of VTubers and Sims, with their permission of course, and have them do- then have them compete in like, challenges in The Sims, and then each episode I kill one of them off. I, I was even, like, trying to make a house for it, but I'm terrible at, like, making houses in The Sims. Like, I'll spend hours, like, making, um, like, characters and shit, but then when I try to make a room, I'm like... Just put a TV in the corner, I guess. I don't know. I would- I am honestly pretty terrible with, like, interior design type shit. <laughs> 
I just kind of throw shit together until something works. And even then, it probably doesn't. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I do need to get back into my Japanese studies. I want to actually, like, learn shit. Because <laughs> I keep, like, falling off when studying that. Exactly. The mods are, like, the fun shit, too. Like, you can find so much weird mods, too. Same. I did that a lot when I played Sims 2. Did you ever have one of those, like, teen pregnancy mods? Because I definitely had one of those when I played Sims 2. It was, like... It was, like, back when, like, teenagers, like, would- there was, like, a lot of, like, weird Sims 2 videos teenagers would make about, like, teenage pregnancy and shit, because we didn't know how else to be dramatic. I definitely downloaded one, and for some reason the particular mod I downloaded came with, like, a naked body skin thing, and it would show up in, um, the, uh, create a sim thing. And I'd always, like, cover that up because I didn't want my parents to see it. Mm, depends on the sandwich. Sometimes tomatoes can just be a mushy mess. And also, if, like, they're sliced too thickly, it's like that. Gotta have good quality tomatoes. Now, pickles... Pickles are also- like, toppings on a sandwich, it's all about, like, what it is- the quality of it itself. Like, I don't get fucking pickles from McDonald's. Fuck that shit. But I will get pickles from Freddy's. Their pickles are the shit. Mm. Uh, but sometimes some places tomatoes can, are just like weirdly mushy on a sandwich, you know? Yeah. Mmm. You know, I think they added werewolves to Sims 4 recently. And people were upset that they weren't sexy, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, they look kind of like furries, but not like furry furries. Yeah, I mean, you've... It has been a while. Have I mean, you've been here the whole time, haven't you, biggest man? <laughs> hmm... I, I know I stream pretty inconsistently at the moment. I'm figuring shit out in my life. I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing, you know? Eh. I don't really- I've only heard like one or two of their songs. And they're okay, I guess. Like, I don't know. Eh. Why you like this, man? immense disappointment. I am disappointed in you, biggest man. What would your mother think? <laughs> mm. Mm. As- Yeah, you're on thin fucking ice, my dude. Sophie? Why are you yelling? Hmm. Okay, I think I might legit fall asleep. <laughs> and... Oh? Hello? <laughs> made another one. I feel like you made another one, biggest man. Kitty. What? Hold on, I have... Hold on, I have stuff. Ah, honey buns. It's so, so sweet of you. Thank you for... Just... Being very sweet in the Discord, and I can't see because Kitty <laughs> keeps moving her big fat butt. <laughs> Won't move her big fat butt. Aww. 
You're purring pretty loud, baby. This was just like the other day when I was trying to play Fall Guys with Ravi and you kept jumping up in front of me just as I was like tr jumping and trying to like in at in opportune moments. You always chose the worst moments to do that, baby. I love you anyway, though. I was trying to play with you earlier, but you didn't want to play, did ya? You didn't. You just stood there. But no, now you want snuggles. Now it's snuggle time. Now it's like, oh, mama, want, I want mama to play, huh? Big smoochies. Hmm. Big smooches. Hmm. <sighs> have y'all ever been- have y'all ever gotten, like, massages and shit? Um, my mom got a, uh, she won a contest to get a, uh, back massage at, like, this random hotel's, like, spa. And she- and- she didn't want to use it, so she gave it to me and my sister to use, and it was really nice. And like, the masseuse lady was super cool, she was real fun to talk to the whole time. <laughs> Honestly, I really fucking needed that shit. Never had one? That makes sense. They can be hard to get one, especially even if there is one in your area, like they can be kind of expensive. The reason I got that one was because like we won a contest. <laughs> but you know, there's there's like something to be said about like treat yourself days. It doesn't have to be like anything extravagant like a massage or anything, but Sometimes just like, you know, putting a face mask on and getting, taking a nice bath with some tea. Or even not just doing that, maybe like turning on some Animal Crossing and galaxy lights and chilling for a bit with some water and... I don't know, just... True, you should, as you should, your body is a temple. Everyone, my body is also a temple. The one that accepts blood sacrifices. Um, yeah. Mm. But like, self care isn't even just that. Sometimes it's just like, hey, take a minute, treat yourself. <laughs> but sometimes self care is like, take a minute to be like, hey, how am I feeling right now? What do I feel like it's excessive and don't do as often that I should- that I can do for myself, you know? It's like, I don't know. For some people it can be as simple as eating a snack they like. Even, like, just remember in all the hustle and bustle Temple Foundation strong skin care make temple pretty. But yeah, um, <laughs> um, treating, well like, um, self-care can also be like just taking time to rest, taking time to, well, just take care of yourself, you know, just have, like, don't worry or work all the time, you know, is what I'm trying to say. And that can be hard for a lot of people. Especially if they struggle to make ends meet. Your temple, well, you can, well, I'm sure your temple is very pretty. I'm sure temple very pretty. Temple does not need perfectly clear skin to be pretty. Temple does not need to be skinny or buff to be pretty. Pretty is whatever you make it. And honestly... It's a temple. Temples are just cool. Like, a lot of temples, whether it be simple or elaborate, like, all have inherent beauty to them. And honestly, even if something's not pretty, like, it's still, like, 
inherently valuable, you know? Just because something you don't... Just because something... I don't know, just because, like, sometimes... Again, beauty is relative, honestly. Beauty standards are fucked, but... Yeah. I don't know, it might be kind of weird coming from me. But, like... How am I trying to say this? Basically that, like... Even things that aren't aesthetically pleasing, even things that... Because, like, we put so much value on appearance, we put so much value on what we are, or even our abilities, or even just existing. Everything has to have a purpose, everything has to be pretty, everything has to have value, but everything already has value. You have value. You have value regardless of whether you're pretty, whether you're smart, whether you're athletic. You have value just by existing, you know? It can be hard to accept that kind of thing. Honestly, with the way the world acts about it, it's easy to, like, forget. But you have value. No matter what. You, you're a human being. You're taking up space, and you're... And you deserve it. You deserve to take up space deserve to just be, you know? I, I don't know if I'm making any sense. Oh, you you leaving, baby? You leaving, kitty cat? Alright, goodbye. She's like, no, I'm not here for this philosoph so philosophical bullshit. <laughs> hmm. Sorry, I'm just like chatting in the Discord. Mm. Yeah, I'm just here with my like little Luna Moth plush in my lap, just just touching it, just fidgeting with it. Ooh, is it good? Cause I always have they always have rainbow they have a lot of rainbow cakes at the store now. And I'm like, yes, but also like, is it good? Ooh, I hope it's good. You know what I should do for my birthday? I should, or at least on stream, for our birthday stream. Damn, August is like next month, isn't it? Holy shit, I can't believe I've been doing this shit for like a year. Holy shit. <laughs> but yeah, I was saying that like maybe for, maybe I should like have like a little rainbow cake for our birthday stream. Exactly! It is July! Ah! What the fuck is time? Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. Honestly, I kind of just do this shit casually. So, like... Damn, though. Exactly! Your birthday's in August too, but like, yours is a lot earlier in August than mine. Oh shit, I need to get you a present! I don't know what I'm gonna get you! Shit! <laughs> uh, I should draw you something. I need to have drawing energy again. <laughs> that day is not today though. I want to get you something, though. You deserve to have something nice. Doesn't have to be anything fancy, of course, but, like, I don't know. It would be nice to get you something. Plus, honestly, it'd probably be less expensive to make something, or... Also, like, if I draw you something, like, digitally, I won't have to, like, ship it to you, which would be expensive. <laughs> Sorry. But, like, shipping stuff is expensive. Yeah, it'd be nice to make you something. Seriously, shipping shit is expensive. By the way, Robbie. You know how, like... 
I lost my train of thought, sorry. Mm. Oh, birthday pie! What's in birthday pie? Tell me. <laughs> Do you like making pies, biggest man? What kind of pie do you like, Robbie? I like cherry pie a lot. But there's like a lot of pies I haven't had. Strawberry pie can be pretty good. It just depends on how it's made. Birthday pie is best pie. <laughs> mm, oh, pumpkin pie is really good. I, You know, one pie I've never had. I've never had rhubarb. Never, never had rhubarb pie. Mmm... Like, I hear it's, like, good. It's, like, very tart. I don't like pecan pie. I just... It's not that it's... I don't know. I don't like pecans. I don't... I don't know. I think it's just the pecans for me. They're, I don't like the texture of pecans. Oh. Oh, what? Oh, no. Big good man. Big good man. Big man. Damn, I had so many like topics I want to talk about before, but now they're just like out of my brain. I need to write this shit down. <laughs> oh my god. They do, they do though, they kind of look like weird bugs. Like, the world's a fucking crazy place right now. Every once in a while. I neither like pecans nor peas. They're both gross to me. But, um... What was I, what was I saying? I am very tired. Brain is just... Out of the window right now. Um. Really? Why do you eat stuff you don't like? Why do you hurt yourself like this, dude? <laughs> Yo. I appreciate it, but it's not even, like, late for me or anything. It's just, like, ten. I am tired, but honestly, I want to keep talking. <laughs> Especially since, like, a lot of times I'll have shifts that go, like, to this late. I don't want to be, like, tired for those. I had, like, an earlier shift today, so that's why I wanted to stream a bit. I also wonder if it's, like, this music that's making me sleepy. But legit, um... Oh, right. Now I remember what I was talking about. So, like, the world's a fucking terrible, terrible fucking place. We all know this. And it's very unsafe to be basically anything that isn't, like, white cis man that's straight. But, like... I don't know. Every now and again, I'll see something that, like, Makes me realize, hey, there's places where the world is becoming safer. Not everywhere, but some places, and people make that. And maybe all the efforts in the past few years haven't been completely in vain. Well, not even just a few years, like, lots of years. But like, you know, like, the world sucks, but like, We'll try to be less shitty. People, like, 
it feels like at some there's some little things out there that make you feel like, hey, maybe over the years people's like collective efforts to like make the world less shitty haven't like been in vain. It's like actually done some shit for some people. It may not things may be going south in a lot of places, but sometimes it's good to remember that hey, you're you're good. And there's people out there that are able to help make shit better. I don't know. I can't put my thoughts into words right now. But maybe Robbie's right. Maybe I should go to bed. You know what? Maybe I will. I'm pretty tired. But honestly, it was really nice chatting with y'all. Honestly, I don't I didn't really have the energy for like any huge streams or anything, but oh. It's always nice to just chill and talk, you know? Let's see if there's anyone we can raid. Uh, who's streaming right now? Also, you know, sore throat, so that's why I'm a bit quiet. <laughs> the first thing I see when I go to the Twitch's main page is this girl in like a fully pink getup with a pink girl girl hat with a microphone with a frog and a disco ball on it playing the piano. I'm like, damn, I love your vibe. I wish I could be you. Uh, who is... You know what? Let's, let's raid Briar Bay. She's, I've seen a bit of her stuff. She's a newer, she's a, she's a, uh, streamer I've started checking out recently. She's really cool. Let me just, Briar. Yeah. I don't know, because sometimes you just need to talk. You just need... Did I spell Briar right? <laughs> Sometimes you just need to talk without thinking, you know? You just... exist. <laughs> I literally was just talking about that, but like, you know, you have value existing. Okay. Let's raid Briar! What? I don't... She's playing as Boo. I don't know what game that is, but I'm sure she's... I'm sure she's having a great time. Y'all be nice to her. Don't make me turn this fucking bus around, all right? Y'all have fun. <laughs> Goodbye. I'm gonna go to bed now.